Well, the Jags training camp is underway, and most fans show up to a Jags game for two reasons, Tanika. They love football, mm -hmm. and they love the team, even in rough times. But for a local Army veteran, it was a Jags four-legged teammate that caught his eye. And after months of asking, what if the two have now made an unexpected bond? He's new, the new guy in the family, but I think he's going to fit in pretty well. Most dogs have a special connection with their owner. I'm not going to try to convince Mojo to be a Browns fan because it's just not something you do to somebody that you like. But most friends don't meet the way Adam and his service dog did. I've been watching Mojo since last summer when he was at camp with the Jaguars. Every time they post a picture of Mojo, I think I'd show my wife and I'd be like, man, can you imagine? If I got a dog like this, like, like this dog. Having the Jags rookie retriever isn't something Adam thought would happen, but it didn't stop him from wondering. This is the, that's the type of dog I want. And now, with a little time and hope. I remember walking through the door and just being, you've got to be kidding me. It's the dog he's got. We took a little while warming up to each other, but uh, after a couple days, we're... Yeah, I'd say we're pretty pretty attached at the moment. The newfound pals were paired through Ponte Vedra's K-9 for Warriors. The nonprofit matches Army veterans like Adam with dogs after their service. He's extra close and paying attention, and I, I see it. I see it every day, and I'm kind of amazed. Now, the two are always attached, from the front yard to the stadium seat. It'll be good. We'll watch a lot of football on Sundays. And Adam says they're taking no time to pause. I really enjoy just going and doing things and just knowing that, I mean, this dude's going to be with me every step of the way.